Ready? Two. And one. Take Barton Barton Town. Town. Ready, Slate. CG. <sighs> Boy, Wait, do so I love bars and tone. Fifteen. Oh, Wait. shit, sorry. Uh, okay. eleven, ten, nine, eight, oh, yeah. seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And take slate, lose that tone, thank you. <laughs> how long are we on this for? Pete, how long uh, 15, are we on this I for? Think. So, uh, 45. Okay, ready, count. Seven, <laughs> six, five. Four, three. Oh, really? Yeah, oh, ready, black, seconds. and take black. Ready, countdown. Three, two, one. Take countdown. Nine, eight, uh, ready, still seven, one. six, five, four, oh, ready? three. Okay, wait, ready, camera two. Two, one. And take camera two with um, Mike and Q Talent. Hello, everyone, and welcome ready, still to Down one. with ASP. Uh, playback guesses. four. I am your host, Matt Price. Playback for the next 28 back minutes and 30 seconds, we will give you the best tips on how to set up the oh. best football watch party in your neighborhood. With that said, let's kick things off. The show starts right now. Take playback four. We are coming out on two. 20. Ten, nine, eight, seven, oh, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And take camera two, Mike and Q Town. Ready, Welcome one. back to Down with ASP, the guest list. Today I will be joined by football party expert Charlie Brooks, as he and I will be making a fan favorite food for football parties. Take one. As well as discussing ways for fellow viewers to interact with each other rather than spending time on their electronic devices. Yeah. You will get the party started in just a few moments, but first, we will take a quick time out. Do one. not move a muscle. The guest list will return after these messages. And dissolve with pump. Ready, fade no, to black. black. Okay. No, 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 no. Ready, uh, ready, playback. Which one, Connor? Uh, four. Uh, ready, four. And take playback, four. Is there ladies? Don't, uh, don't. Right from the camera to the screen. Okay, no fade. <laughs> and then, There's okay, okay. Three. okay. Black, two so Okay. And what, uh, ready, play back three. Okay. Fifteen in uh this commercial. <laughs> Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And take play back three. I'll never forget the day I landlord Ready, called still and said, one. "Read your lease." So no this pets don't allowed. fade to black. Just my owner tells him, "My dog the lease," but that didn't work, and now I'm stuck in a shelter. But this pit bull is ready okay. for a okay. new crib. Okay. I'm loving, loyal, and play well with others. Okay. So don't be intimidated by all my muscles, cause the biggest Ten, one I have nine, is my heart. Ten, nine, eight, <laughs> seven, six, five, Ready, dip to black. four, three, two, one. And dip come out on still store one with bump. Ready, camera two. Camera two, start your slow zoom. Or, oh, I'm sorry, wait, ready, camera one. And take one, Mike and Town. Welcome back to the guest list. I am Matt Price. Obviously, every weekend, football fans from all across the country will want to call all uh, their ready, friends key. over to. Uh, Charlie Package is in. Turn on the so, uh, playback four. And put on the game, or games, that they are oh so desperate to watch. Key. However, what is the most proper way? To set up parties ready, like these, still store, uh, I met up or, with football ready, expert and my buddy four. Charlie Brooks to oh, give ready, me ready, his ready, thoughts ready. on the best ways to prepare for something so exciting and fun. Take player four. Play. Yeah. It's game day. After I wake up, I go to my closet and I check to see what jersey I'm going to wear for that specific Sunday. Then I quickly realize every Saturday night I sleep in my Seattle Seahawks jersey. After picking out my jersey for the day, I go downstairs and, and on I one. go to see what mess was left from the night before and help clean that up. After my friends and I had a good night of reading Bible verses and playing contentious rounds of Yahtzee. 25 seconds uh, left in this roll-in. Camera three, can you zoom in a little bit? Once I am Just done cleaning up, 
the room. I move around the furniture so that everyone has the optimal view 14, position of the football game. Then 10, that, 9, 8, the 7, so 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And Mike and Q Town take one. Well, Charlie now joins me in the studio wearing his same 12th man Seattle Seahawks Z Charlie, thank you so much for stopping yes. by to give all of us your takes. So my first question to you is, what would you do if you were to invite people over to your place, but you do not uh, have enough seats? Would you order three minutes table? Table? Would you get folding chairs? Ready, you know, give us your perspective on this aspect of the football party preparations. Take three, ready well, key. Well, Matt, thanks for inviting me onto the show. It's great to be here. Right, take Personally, for me, if there aren't right, no, enough seats in the room for the party, I have two solutions. Key. First would be to see if I can bring furniture Ready? in from uh, other rooms. <coughs> they have yeah. furniture in the living room or anywhere else and find <coughs> something that people can sit on. If that doesn't work, then just ask some guests to sit wherever they want. Ready Maybe to. say say sharing some chairs or some other uh, other options. Take two. Now no matter how many people you have over, you need something to watch the games on. Yep. What piece of technology would you use if you were to host something like this? Would it be a projector? Would it be a 55 or 72 inch plasma screen TV? What would you get? Take well, three. I have a nice large TV where I usually Ready stream. One. So I like that because it has good picture quality. Also, if you don't have the cable service, then I usually like to use two minutes computer, left in segment and I have an HDMI cord and I would plug in the laptop to the TV because the TV has the best picture quality <coughs> that's my technology of choice. Now how Take would one. you, other friends of yours and other football watching buddies come to terms on what games you would put on if many of you are fans of different teams, whether it's the Giants, Jets, Steelers, Patriots, Bills, Texans, Bucks, so on. Uh, well, take. usually my solution is that if someone wants to watch a different game, I'll ask them that they bring minute and a half device, left in like segment, like a laptop or a phone or iPad or something like that, that we can set up ne a game nearby so we can simultaneously watch multiple games at the same time. Ideally, though, the goal is to have everyone engaged in the same game on the television. So Sunday night football, Monday night football, Thursday Ready, night. Those are all really easy to set uh, up. To for. zoom out. And what is your favorite way Stop. to watch football Take coverage two. when you have multiple games going on at once? Take well, I like focusing on just the one minute game left in segment on the TV. So people who have those other devices, I can look at those devices as well. But just really focus on the main screen and then occasionally look over to the other screens. Take two. And. I guess my last question to you would be, do you or anyone on your guest list pretend to call games over the broadcasters, or you just watch, listen, and react? Take. Well, I don't mind if people broadcast or to call games, but I like to listen. 30 seconds when I left watch, in segment. hear what Ready the broadcasters one. are saying. Obviously, the there's some up. broadcasters that people well, don't question, like. So, yeah. so in those situations, they, can, I don't mind can finish people this answer, definitely. Bro broadcast yep. themselves, but I want them to let me know that they're going to do mm. that. Well, those are Take really, one. really great tips. Thank you so much, Charlie, for that. You know what else is important, though, besides those preparations? Uh, ready, still store one. The food. When we come back, Charlie and I will take you through some great cooking methods to prepare a brand new watch party meal that it's all in, football uh, fans are cravery, craving excuse me, every stuff. single weekend. Keep it right here. You are watching Down with ASP, the guest list. All right, dissolve to still store one with bump. Ready, playback four. Dip and ready, black. Dip, black, and come out on. Alright. Alright. We didn't fix the cards. Can you just tell me the order? Really quick? Uh, three. Do you have the order, Matt? Uh, uh, that block finished out like right as, like on time. That block finished like right on time. Yeah. Okay, Emma. Matt has the seven of clubs. Seven. Queen six. of hearts. We can, we can eight of hearts. Right here. It's the three. Five of clubs. Two. Six of spades. One. Of and Saints. switch. I'll Just never forget the day our landlord called and said, read your lease. No pets allowed. My owner tells him my dog ate the lease, but that didn't 20 work. seconds and left and break. I'm stuck in a shelter, but this pit bull is ready for a new crib. I'm loving, I'm loyal, and play well with others. So don't be intimidated by all my muscles. 10, the biggest one 9, I have is my 8, heart. 7, <laughs> 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And dissolve the still store 1. Oh, sorry. Uh, ready, camera two. 
and take camera two, Mike Newton. Welcome back, everybody. Matt Price alongside today's guest, Charlie Brooks, my friend. What is a Ready, football three. watch party without take. one of its most important oh, elements? Go back to two. The food. And over the past couple of weeks, you've been going around and serving a new favorite meal to have at these events. And I'm not talking about hamburgers, cheeseburgers, or hot dogs. I am talking about pizza bagels. Yeah, Take. well, everyone knows about the traditional foods like you mentioned, but pizza bagels are perfect for yep. the party because they can be appetizers or they can be a main dish. They're also very easy to make and make changes if you want. Okay, Charlie, take with two. that said, let's get underway with some home cooking. All right, please take us through right. the process of making this delightful dish. Well, Ready, let's three. take you through take the ingredients three. first. So first we have Ready, the mini bagels that we bought from the store. Just all right. Those are all very nice there. Come back. We have our marinara sauce sitting over here. This Ready, is still store two. the main ingredient you really need mm -hmm. for a bagel. Take, take then still over store here two. you have your mozzarella cheese the mozzarella cheese is very nice. three minutes left mm -hmm. in segment and you also have the pepperoni come back pepperoni is a little Ready, added one. one in case you want to put Take it on one. it's always very nice for someone to put on your pizza come back. bagel and then we have some cut up one. bell peppers Take. these are a little spicy so mm. don't put them on if Take. you don't want spice but football fans they definitely love Ready their two. spices all right Take well two. let's get started shall we so please, ex so right. please, uh, let's uh, explain Ready, the three. process. So let's each grab two mini bagels. Okay. Two and a half four. minutes left in segment. So the first thing we're going to grab is the marinara take sauce. Four. Mm -hmm. So take a good spoonful of it, and you can just spritz it on all around. Maybe put it on and then move it around. Well, that looks very, very spritz. good. Oh, it does. You just uh, put it take. on both bagels really quickly. That's a good zoom. All right, I'll That's take a little there. bit of that while we show the next ingredient. Uh, Ready to take two. And then I have the cheese, so I'll move on to the cheese right Ready now three. while he's putting take three. his sauce on. So I take Two minutes left in segment. Four. And then I just take four. move it around the bagel. Mm, these look tempting already. Take three. Oh, uh, yes, they do. They're Oops, very good. Right. Wow. That's all good. Ready two. Okay. Take two. put uh, the ingredients that we've already used over here. Ready all right, three. what's next? Take now, three. Now I will Ready put four. the pepperoni, a couple of slices of this four, onto each Charlie's. bagel. Grab about two slices, one slice for each. All right, so once well, you're done with the cheese, I will take. hand these off to you. But one thing you should know about me is that I do not Ready mix two. meat with Minute dairy. and a half take left two. in so segment. So I will just put these over here. Ready, three. Little, and then hand me the peppers. You can put this on, obviously. Take three. Take about Ready, four. a couple of these on the spoon. Take four. And just Ooh. mix them up here. Ready. You really like uh, to spice take. things up. You put this, three on that. This one. really does spice it up. You take probably two. only want to put two, but... <laughs> getting a little, getting a little dangerous here. Put three on. Left, <laughs> uh, oh man, these look about very, a minute very five good. seconds. Okay. And these go. are your pizza bagels, and then we'll put them either in the microwave now or it's a minute in the left. oven. The oven would take about 10, 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. Now, unfortunately, we do take. not have an oven, and we do not have enough time to show that whole cooking process. But that is why Charlie did something a little special for us. You made Coming pizza bagels just, a, just hair, yesterday. Just a have a look at these, everybody. Just take a look. So beautiful. Now, take I understand one, uh, we have two one, plain, one. one pepperoni, and one pepper. Yes, we have take. three different kinds here. We have the two plain or cheese Ready, bagels, three. and then we have one pepperoni, uh, and we have uh, one with a little spice with the peppers on it. 30 so seconds left in segment. Really amazing take. how you have more than one pizza bagel. All right, so let's Ready, just uh, let's just quickly take, take a bite out of these. Choose any one we want. We'll right. both go for the cheese, Ready, I guess. Yeah, let's do it. Take two. Ready? Mmm. Wow. Ready three, take three. Ready one. As I mentioned, take these one. are very easy to make depending mm -hmm. on what take. kind you like. So uh, these are one. very R3. easy. Need these to are wrap. definitely my go-to for the party. Absolutely. Wow, ready Charlie, two. you are take a two. genius, my friend. It, these are just so good. I can't wait to try these at your next football party. Ready one. All right. And play back that is very delicious. But really uh, so, you know what else is very delicious? Continuing on with the show. Mm. When we come back, we're gonna have more with Charlie. Charlie. Stay tuned. And take still store. Uh, ready, playback four. Ready black. Ready playback four. And dip the black out on four. Lose bump. Is dessert ladies. Uh, uh, my bad on those that. You're good. Three. <laughs> about like 20 seconds over. Yeah, 25 seconds over right now. 25. Yeah, it's not bad. Just cut time from F block. Yeah. Uh, 
Oh. Sharing so it's four, icing on the three, cake from the two, Church of Jesus Christ one. of Latter Day Saints. Take playback three. Julie was always a, a voracious reader. She carried what? two novels on an airplane because she'd read one on a three, four hour ride. All right, and Kyle, you'll just get the block. 20, 20 seconds left in break. I noticed that she would read a page and couldn't remember what she had just read, and she'd have to go back and read it again. I don't remember much these days after I read, but less does for me, and I love it. Oh, and three, block. two, one. Uh, dip to black out on still store with bump. It's all good. Uh, ready, to, uh, ready to. And Mike Q talent take two or just alt two. Welcome back, everybody. Matt Price alongside my guest Charlie Brooks. Okay, right. we discussed setting two. up for a football party. Perfect. We prepared food for a football party. Seems as if everything is right as rain right now. Now, right? <laughs> wrong. And I was wrong to say that, but at times, during breaks or after games, partiers will do something that the hosts would not expect them to do. Look at their phones. So, when you see your guests like that, Charlie, how does that make you feel? Ready, three. Well, it Take makes three. me angry because I put all this effort into making sure that the party was set up. And three minutes left in segment? With each other. I think it, it's just a little annoying that they're in, only interacting with their phones. And, and the roll ins in uh, playback How four. Are you? Or what, is it more take. Take. Yep, yeah. yep, my bad. Uh, I would say it's a 10 uh, because, take again. Of, as I said, I put the party together and no one's interacting with each Camera other. Actually, so it does make me very annoyed like and I just and want everyone down. to put the effort in to try and talk with each other. Uh, now, being perfect. the football party take planning two. expert that you Ready are. One. What do you believe sorry, ready, drives two and a half minutes left down at their electronic devices rather than socialize with the others around them? Take three. Well, no, I think it's just everyone has the impulse to check their fantasy football teams, especially as a football party. You, you're, everyone is looking at their phones in general, and then you see your fantasy football team, and you see who's doing well and who's not doing well. And there's yeah. just these breaks in action where everyone can look at their phone really quickly because it's only in commercials or it's only two minutes time or it's after the game so it's really easy to look at your phone now whether it's during a commercial break halftime report or even after the game what is the average amount of time that one of these partiers will look at their electronic devices Take three. well i don't think there's a real <coughs> sorry it's okay i don't think there's a real exact amount of time that people look at their phones because of the various amounts of downtime game because some games are higher scoring which means more commercials <coughs> but i think the fans take Shut any up. break they One can get no, minute and a half <laughs> because they have 22. that they're right in their grasp in their pocket maybe and they want to see fantasy fantasy football or they want to see twitters and the fact that we have the technology already with us because we're streaming on it just adds to the amount of times during breaks we want to use it because it's very quick access and you get all those vibrations for notifications. Take two. On a serious note, do you believe that this could cause an One minute. Likewise? Take three. Well, that's not my expertise. I, I go for one. the party planning. But I would say I think there is some health issues with phones and with technology in general. But I don't think football party fans really add to the amount of of the health effects. Because I think you're already looking at the screen seconds. no matter what. So looking down at your phone during a break isn't going to impact you that much because you're already looking at a TV screen, a laptop, or a phone screen. 30 seconds. So I think it's just really easy, and I, I think it's already impacting health. And very quickly, how much would it mean to you if the tables were quickly turned? Take three. 20. I think it would be really nice just Ready to two. have the people there putting the effort in. 15 seconds just left. Making sure that they're right. actually socializing. Well, Take to get two. an idea of what Charlie and I are talking about just take a look and you'll you'll uh, see what ready we play four. four and take and roll <coughs> all right sorry my bad I didn't play we're good, no, we're good. Hey guys wait guys guys what did you think of the, the game all right so we're tossing the break hey after guys, this then going to break do, do you hear me uh, are, are you okay guys hey yo guys guys are you okay you, you, you're not watching the game at all come on guys Big selfie guy? <laughs> is, there, is anything wrong or any emergencies happening or anything like that? Or? 25 seconds.
15. Uh, ready one, actually. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. If I can do talent, take one. When we come back, Charlie is going Ready to show us a one. great way to help solve this problem. Uh, we are putting all the four. cards on the table playback for this four, idea. Right. Back after this. Dissolve to still store one. Ready, playback four. And dip to black, out on playback four. Is there ladies? Perfect. Ready, three. Yep. Uh, we're eight seconds oh, over. Oh, perfect. Three. These look good. Uh, we're eight over right now. Eight seconds. Yeah. Eight Not eight minutes over. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> this commercial's hard. Sharing. It's the ice cream on the cake from the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter Day Saints. And take playback three. Julie was always Thirty seconds left in break. Reader. Sorry, not counting that one down. Two novels on an airplane because she'd read one on a three, four it, hour ride. In my brain already, so. And at some point, I began Good. to notice that she would no, not. read a page and couldn't remember. <laughs> Fifteen left in break. Read, and she'd have to go back and read it again. Is this a dip to black or no? I don't yep, remember dip to black. much these days. Number one, can you actually get a, a shot of Matt instead of it. the cards for now? Oh wait, no, never mind. Never two, mind. one. Ready and dip to black. Come out on still sword one. Ready, camera two. And Mike and Q talent, take camera two. Back here on Down with ASP, Matt Price alongside my guest, Charlie Brooks. Now in the last segment, Charlie, you and I discussed how it can be very aggravating to have football party guests playing with their phones or any other electronic devices during game pauses and or other breaks. Well, you actually brought playing cards with you because you have a game. That Three and a half minutes left uh, in a segment. Partially solved some of that problem, am I right? Take yes, I did bring a card game with me today. It's called Mao. Think of Uno a little bit, similar to Uno. Trying to get rid of all of your cards. But in this, you're trying to match the suit or the number instead of matching the color. Mm. Whereas that's the goal of Uno. All right, well, let's play two. this for a couple minutes, and you will explain as we go, because there's some crazy rules to this game. Yes, yeah, so pick up your cards now. Take camera right. four. So you are actually going to go first. We already have right. our first two. card first off the top card of the down. pile. If that is a three of... Clubs, so I'm gonna go oh, with ready a one. seven. We're under three minutes left in the segment. So there's a rule with seven. Uh, ready, still store two. You put down a seven, then the next person Take has to put two. down a seven until the a seven ready cannot two. be played. So the player then who doesn't have the sevens then has to draw that amount of cards. So I'll put Take. down a seven of hearts. All right, and I do not have any other sevens right now, so I'll have to pick up the next two then. Am yes, I right? Two minutes. As Very good. well as or getting skipped because the I mean, three minutes, sorry. is also working as a skip, so I'll go next. I'll put down a two of hearts. And I'll put down the <coughs> same two, just a different number, an eight of hearts. There's another rule with oh, eight. Oh my goodness Take still store two. The eight actually reverses the order of play, so because it's just the two of us, we won't reverse the order, but Take in two. a natural... Ready, three. Multiple person where there's maybe three, three, three or four three. people. It would change camera three. Clock, clockwise to counter Ready, clockwise. I guess get up. Two That's minutes left. Really Take camera easy four. Easy rule there. Okay. Ready two. So let's keep going. I'll put Take down two. a six of hearts. Okay. And let's see. I Ready, still store am two. going to now put down a six of spades. Take still store two. There's two rules now you have to know with this six of spades. So for the suit, you changed it. So now I have to say changing things up. Changing things up. And then because you put 10 in spade also, you have to say the number of spades. So you have to Which is say a six of spades. So changing things two. up with a six of spades. Minute and a half. Yeah. Ready, oh, right. down really quickly. Okay. Then the hang of this. Four. So now Looks I like will put down my next card. My next card is an ace. An ace Ready. works as two. a skip. So now I two. skip over you again. Ready, camera two. And there is only Ready. one card Take left. Two. Which means I just have to say Mao, which is the name of the game. Mm -hmm. oh, they're going to have to stretch. You know, and y if you call me before I say that, then I would have to pick up a card. But since you're just learning that, you uh, know that. Minute left in segment. So I can put down this last card, the Jack of Spades, and I win the game. Jack Ready? also works uh, as take. a wild card. So no matter what Ready, the Jack one. was, it w still would have won the game for me. Take camera one. And I lost. Ready, camera <laughs> yeah, two. But hey, I mean, take look, it's, this is a fun game. I like this. What made you want this to be a uh, part of the party? Camera four. Well, you 40 seconds left in segment. Game to play at halftime, keep your mind going, and it's really quick and simple to play. If I 
So I won this game, now the next game... 30 seconds left in segment. Three. Up, but I can't tell anybody, and then if you break those rules, then you would be having to pick up cards. Even though you don't know the rule, I'm still going to make you pick up cards. Because I changed up a little um, in my mind. Take well, two. the name of the game is Mao. Three letters for that three-letter game. Wow. That is a really, <laughs> really great game. Uh, Charlie, thank you so five much seconds left for in, this uh, game. Program. For or, the I pizza mean, bagels segment. and the party right, planning preparations. Fantastic. This is why he's an expert. Ready I will be right one. back with some final thoughts. But first, we have to take a break. You're watching Down with ASP, the guest list. Dissolve to still store one. Uh, playback Ready four. Ready to dip the black. And take dip to black. Come out on playback Did four. Did you do it, ladies? Uh, we're three seconds over right now. Nice. Yeah, nice work with the bump, Ryan. Watch the square full again. Ready to play back three. 45 seconds left in break. Sharing, it's the icing on the cake. Two, the Church of Jesus one, Christ of Latter Day Saints. Take play back three. Julie was always a, a voracious reader. She carried two and novels on 25 seconds left in break. One, Camera two. Three, four hour Camera ride. two. Yeah. And at some point, I began to notice that she would read a page and couldn't remember what she had just read, and she'd have to go back and read it again. 10, I don't remember nine, much these eight, days after I read, seven, but less does six, for me, and I love it. Five, four, three, Ready, two, to black. one. Dips black come out on still store one. Ready camera two. And Mike Q Talent, take camera two. Welcome back everyone. Matt Price here. With some final thoughts for you here on the guest list. Charlie Brooks and I did did provide some great football party preparations. Now here are some facts that could very much come in handy for everyone, especially fans of football in the very near future. Fact number one. If you are cooking grilled cheese sandwiches for this Ready, party, do not, I repeat, do not plan on inviting Takeru Kobayashi minute and a half as left he holds segment. the world record for eating 13 grilled cheese sandwiches in one minute. God bless him. Take camera one. Fact number two. If you have heard of the urban Ready, legend that the Super Bowl's quote-unquote big flush causes an <laughs> overload on America's sewage systems, fear not, because this myth has been proven False. Ready, camera two, and Fact number three. Do not sit too long. Ready, camera three. Even if you are on the couch, you could get a back injury, and it could technically Minute qualify left in segment. as a football injury. And believe me, I know. Charlie and I, we just sat in chairs for almost half the show. I'm feeling fine, but we don't want to sit there too long. Take camera three. And fact number four. With that said, don't forget to take breaks. Use the restroom. Walk around. Throw a football around. <sighs> with friends. <laughs> or... Just play a game of Mao. And Mao, believe me, Mao's a great game. It was much so much fun. Charlie uh, and I had a great time. 30 and seconds. 30 seconds till you need to hit the when outro. It comes to that game. Okay. It's a lot of fun. I really highly recommend it. Well, with that said, that's just going to about wrap things up here on the guest list edition of okay. Down Ready, with ASP. Uh, Once again, special one. thanks to my good friend Charlie Brooks, our football party planning CD expert, on for coming on the show. Yep. Charlie is always invited back, and so are other guests who will put on great tips. Join us he next time when Pete Johans will stand right alongside me to discuss ways to set up for a grade A moron party. It will be interesting to see what he has to say about that. Oh, boy. On behalf of everyone here at Down With ASP, yep. I'm Matt Price. Six. Have a good day, everyone, and party hard, America. Ready? And does all this still store one? Ready? CG1. 30 and seconds take. left till black. Next. 25. Next. Next. 20. This is my guilt. Next. Yeah. Next. <clears throat> 10. Next. 9. Next. 8. Next. 7. 6. Next. 5. Next. 4. 3. 2. Ready, fade to black. 1. And fade to black. <laughs>